Here we go. This is the Space Diary by, I guess it's the Emperor's Daughter. I don't Emperor's know her daughter. name. But she's the Emperor's Daughter, and she's writing a diary about what's going on on Arrakis. Let's listen. Imperial Diary, year 10,191, third comment. The battle for Arrakis waste of ammo. took everyone by surprise. Super waste of ammo. There were no witnesses. The Harkonnen operate. It's already burning. Stop, stop guys. <laughs> what do you mean there's no witnesses? It's the whole planet saw. That's right. So I guess so. people on planet Arrakis saw the Harkonnen come down mm -hmm. and kill all the Atreides. However, beyond that, like, I don't know if there was communications off planet. I see. Like, so you're from, saying from the rest of the galaxy's perspective, they just may be like, uh, House Atreides, I don't get messages from them anymore, but I don't know. I but don't is, know. This a, is this some kind of weird messed up classism we're listening to? They're like, a bunch of poor people saw it. They don't count. They're not witnesses. That's right. Our people didn't see it. Therefore, That's right. therefore it doesn't count. It. Yeah. Also, she is the emperor's daughter. So if information gets all the way up to her, then it's almost at the emperor. So I wonder if it's one of those things where it's like people don't talk around the, about it around the emperor because it's a highly political thing. Like the emperor does what he does. Like, don't question it. Uh, yeah. Okay. Could be. So she's like, I didn't hear about it. Therefore, there's no witnesses. Nobody. Yeah. But everyone on every planet's <laughs> talking about it. <laughs> and when she enters the room on every planet, everyone's like. Shh. Yeah. Let's see what else she got. Operation was perpetrated overnight without warning or declaration of war by morning. The Atreides were no more. All died in the dark. And the Emperor said nothing since that night. Wait, so, oh, hold on a second. So there, she's like, it happened overnight. Like we had grand armies, operations, ships. I mean, this doesn't happen overnight. This takes weeks, months of planning to get all these things into fighting shape, operationally ready. Overnight. What am I saying? Gosh, does that mean that the emperor's daughter is not aware of what the houses are doing with their militaries? Because it's like I, the Harkonnens just just killed people, I guess. I don't know. Like, right? Right. So I guess they have maybe, maybe the emperor has really poor intelligence. They have no idea what the militaries of the houses are actually doing. Plus, she seems super naive, not understanding that militaries take time to build up. She's like, it happened overnight. That's because that's when I heard about it. Was, it happened quickly to me. Maybe she is just very junior. Like she's not really ready for the emperor's role. And so <laughs> from her perspective, effectively, she's an intern. And she's like, and things just happen. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. I guess. <laughs> this, I mean, this is all from her perspective. Yeah. It's not been the same, nor have I. His inaction is difficult for me to accept. For I know he loved you, Leto Atreides, like a son. But my father's always been guided by the calculus of power. This would not be the first time the Harkonnens have done his dirty work. In the shadows of Arrakis lie many secrets, but the darkest of them all may remain the end of House Atreides. I mean, is the Emperor some sort of political power-seeking person, or is he just born into it? That's a good question. I mean, she's talking so, about, like, he's, he's, he's manipulating the power, such a power-hungry son of a bitch, like... You were born into it just like he was. That's right. And, if, and in fact, if he doesn't do it, then she's not going to have power. Yeah. What are we talking about here? That's, that's just being in charge. It's being in charge. Yeah. You're being in charge. So even if you don't want to play political games as the person in charge, I think you might have to. Because have people to. underneath you are playing political games. And if you want to see your country or your, I don't know, kids PTA, <laughs> or, or in this guy's case, the emperor, mm -hmm. like if you want to see your empire function correctly under your vision, I think you might have to play political games. Right, so this is like kings and emperors of in our history mm -hmm. where they, they on paper have like absolute power over the realm, but you got to play political games because there's powerful people all over the place and they were overthrown with civil wars and palace plots on the regular. Yeah, they had so. like generations of incest because they were playing political games with mm. the leaders of other countries. But like if, if you don't, then your family, your bloodline can be done. That's right. That's right. Yeah. So I'm not sure what she's talking about here. Of course, he's, he's got to play political games. He's Even if he doesn't want to, he's forced into it, for sure. Yeah. Got to get the spice. 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 Cool painting. 